And now to uh, the stories. The National Assembly, through its Joint Committee on Judiciary, Human Rights and Legal Matters, has demanded for better welfare packages for judicial officers. Requests for better welfare packages for judicial officers from the National Assembly has made, was made during the 2023 Budget Defense Session by the Executive Secretary of National Judicial Council, NJC, Ahmed Gambo Saleh, Chairman of the Joint Committee, Senator Kweyemi Bamidile, who made the request, inged it on his leaked memo from Justices of Supreme Court bordering on poor welfare packages. It says the increment of 120 billion naira to 150 billion naira for judiciary is not enough to cater for welfare of various stakeholders in that harm of government. Be that as it may, I implore you to kindly note that the oversight visits will see take place after this budget defense before the final approval of the judiciary budget. The decision to hold this joint budget session is geared towards ensuring that deliberations are con concluded on the budget on time to enable us to have harmonized reports on the budget. This, no doubt, will save time and make our work easier. Earlier in his submission before the Joint Committee, Ahmed Gambo Saleh lamented that though the NJC has been able to assess 80% of the 2022 budget, the inflation rate in the country had a diverse effect on the budget performance of the Judicial Council. He disclosed that, based on prevailing challenges facing the NJC, the budget proposal submitted to the Ministry of Finance was 338 billion naira, but was given the envelope of 150 billion naira. On each and every vote, for instance, we have to make an additional prohibition of over 20% of the votes appropriated this year, even for us to be able to achieve uh, uh, a milestone achieved this year. As you will recall, the appropriation for the judiciary in this subsisting fiscal year is 120 billion naira. And uh, it's gratifying for me to report this afternoon that of this sum appropriated, we are so far able to access 80% of, uh, of the funds. <laughs> 